Let's explore the hypothetical scenario of detonating a nuclear bomb, specifically the Tsar Bomba, in the Mariana Trench. The Tsar Bomba, a colossal 58.6 megaton nuclear weapon, was a product of the Cold War era, boasting immense power with a blast wave that encircled the globe three times. The Mariana Trench, a remarkable natural feature, is the deepest chasm on Earth, plunging almost 7 miles or 11 kilometers deep and up to 3 miles or 5 kilometers wide, filled with water. Now, envision dropping the Tsar Bomba into the Mariana Trench from a height of 6.5 miles, nearly equal to the trench's depth. What would happen in this underwater explosion? Let's break it down. Firstly, it's crucial to address the challenge of delivering the bomb to the trench's extreme depth. The water pressure at 7 miles reaches an astonishing 110 MPa, 1,100 times normal atmospheric pressure. A conventional nuclear bomb, with its lead outer layer, would be flattened without detonating due to this intense pressure. To avoid this, we'll imagine lowering the bomb inside a bathyscaphe, a deep-sea submersible designed to endure high pressure. Now, let's consider two scenarios. 1. Detonation at 3 to 5 miles depth, 5 to 8 kilometers. The bomb explodes, creating an underwater nuclear test-like blast. However, a colossal tsunami, approximately 400 feet high, emerges, engulfing Japan, Southeast Asia, parts of Australia, and causing significant flooding on the U.S. Pacific coast. Background radiation in the Pacific temporarily increases. 2. Detonation at 5 to 7 miles depth, 8 to 11 kilometers, or at the bottom asterisk. The Mariana Trench lies at the junction of two tectonic plates, the Pacific and the Filipino. If the bomb detonates here, it triggers a powerful shock wave, potentially causing the plates to converge or diverge rapidly. This leads to catastrophic events, mega tsunamis, magnitude 12 earthquakes across the Ring of Fire, volcanic eruptions lasting at least a month, acid rain, and potential nuclear winter. Additionally, a powerful explosion near a tectonic fault might even tear the planet apart, though this is highly unlikely. Fortunately, historical experience has shown that, after the Tsar Bomba's atmospheric test in 1963, nations signed a treaty in Moscow, banning nuclear tests in the atmosphere, outer space, or underwater, a measure to prevent such catastrophic scenarios from becoming a reality.